was over crypto muscle I'm to you another YouTube video. Here we are internationally, renowned, worldwide. I think it's worth that crypto muscle. And the crypto muscle network coming to you with another YouTube video. Let's take a look over here at Polyvera. Oh yeah, Polyvera. We're kicking it off Wednesday morning. Middle of the week. Can you believe it's already middle of the week again? And we're on the cusp of 4th of July. Those of you that are in the United States, it's a big time holiday. Fourth uh, of July, um, you know, because it's uh, Independence Day. But not only that, you got hot, sizzling summers, barbecues, beers, all that stuff. But I, I don't drink beer, though. You know, you know what's funny about me? Here's a fun fact for those of you that may not know. But <laughs> all right, so I work. I used to work in the beer business, right? Used to. Um, and I I grew to hate it, <laughs> and so. Um, but um, it was good when I first started, and then it got bad as time progressed that I ended up getting out of it um, because the money wasn't that great for the hustle you had to do all the time. But uh, besides the fact of that, um, it was a steady job. But um, aside from that, uh, I, wasn't, I wasn't a beer fan. I'm not a beer drinker. <laughs> so I was in the beer business, but I wasn't a beer drinker. Um, I just, I don't know. I just, I wanted to like it cause I tried it, but I just never liked it. I tried different beers, all that stuff. And, um, I don't know. I just, I just didn't like it. And so, um, and when I told people, what did you f try first? Right. People would tell me, you know, ask me, I tried, um, stuff like, for those of you that know beers, uh, I tried, let's see, Bud Ice. Uh, there's a beer that used to be out there called Tequiza, and there's like one other one, and every one of them was just bad. <laughs> I was like, Ugh. never again. I mean, I know a lot of fun facts, stories, and stuff about beer, the history and stuff, um, like Corona. I'll, I'll, I'll give you a quick Corona story, and then that's it, alright, I'll stop with the beer stuff. <laughs> uh, so, you know, it's 4th of July, summer and all that stuff, alright? Um, with Corona, it was made in the early eighties and this was, uh, used, uh, I mean, if, if you know Corona, how it tastes and all that's a harsh beer, right? It's not one of the best beers out there, but what made Corona so popular was the marketing of it, but the making of the beer itself, it's like bottom of the barrel sort of like. You know, undesirable, really, it's not that great of a beer. It was just kind of beer, but cheap at the time when it was made. Bottom of the barrel sort of um, makings of that beer. And if you ask anybody at the time, it's just terrible beer. But what grew to people was the marketing of it. And uh, that's what made Corona sell to this day. Is, yeah, it's not that great, but the marketing of it as a party beer, beach beer, all that stuff is what made it sell as a popular beer. So there you go. That's a fun story. All right, so enough of that. Um, Pauly Vera, by the way, uh, if you're in the U.S., uh, Modelo, another one from Mexico, is actually starting to outsell Corona now. Um, and... It was already, the growth of Modelo was crazy. All right, sorry. Let me, uh, I'll, I'll uh, step off the beer talk. <laughs> now, here's Polyvera. I know it's just the, this whole Corona summer, Polyvera, July 4th, it all is uh, all just, in, you know, subject matter, you know. Uh, maximize your earnings, advanced trading bots. All right, so uh, trade with leading exchange in coins. They use uh, AI technology, or I'm sorry, advanced arbitrage technology. Uh, they use bots, uh, comprehensive support they have, 24-7 trading automation, real-time earning insights, flexible rental plans. All right, we'll take a look at that. Sign up for a free account, rent a bot, activate and earn, just like that. It's really just like that. And uh, Polyver has a chat. Telegram chat if you want to check out their chat right there. 
see what all the fuss is all about in the chat. But yeah, it's been a good run so far, good experience. And so that's where it's at, right? Uh, so let's see my bot list here. Just recently re-upped. Um, I think it was back on Sunday. And then I was just making my regularly scheduled appearance here on YouTube for Polyvera. Usually it's like a Tuesday, Wednesday sort of video. Uh, another 9 hours 51 minutes before this 1.4 is earned. And as you can see here, um, now it's a 50 day plan. So 46 days plus remaining on $1,000. We'll see how it goes. Alright, uh, let's take a look at the withdraws. I don't know if it shows it here. Oh, it's in my Bitcoin. Oh, okay. Let me go look at the history then. So you can see withdraw. It's been completed. Yeah. I think I did verify that one already. So I got a little bit of earnings. I, I used to earn 11, now I earn 14 because I went with a, a, I guess the longer you commit, the, the more that you earn over time. So that's what I did. I don't know if this will go anything specific here. Let's see. There you go. I got a hash ID there. And we can always check it to verify. I'm pretty sure I checked this already. So it wasn't a full week from the last prior update because um, we have some breaking news on the Polyvera front. All right. Well, part of it was because my plan ended. And so I had to um, kickstart a new plan. And um, that's why I was kind of short on earnings because there, it ran. Anyway, it was a couple days where I didn't have it active before I reactivated my plan. And so, uh, let's see here. Got $42 in the tether, so we'll withdraw that out. Uh, let's see. There. $42 balance. We'll max that. Just makes it easy. 2FA. Oh, almost cleared my 2FA. There it is, as soon as possible, they say. Uh, I said this process within 24 hours. So, uh, outside of Bitcoin, a minimum is 20. $5 minimum for everything else. Not bad. Look at that. Withdraw daily limit is set at 500000 Imagine <laughs> clicking some button and be like, yeah, I got to pull out $500,000 today. That'd be a great withdraw. I would love to withdraw that too. But yeah, so uh, that's your latest here on uh, Polyvera. It's been a very good run so far. Uh, how, to, how to get started? Oh, well, pick your bot. Waiting for that Mev bot still. All right, so you pick testing or ARB. Minimum is 50 or 100. 15 days to 30 to 90 calendar days, all depends. All right, this is a breakdown of, you know, if you're going to go 50 days, 90 days. I went with the 50 days and redeposited my $1,000 back in it, uh, which would fall right here at the 1.4% because in between both of these. And that's what I'm making. All right, so it's pretty good. I re-entered on that, and then now just kind of getting started on uh, continuing progress is what it is. But yeah, so I did that. Hit continue. It says um, you know I picked the investment, so continue. Put in the payment. We all know the different payments you can use. All right, Tether, Tether, Cardano, Stellar. BNB, BNB, uh, Ripple, Dash, Tron, Doge, Ethereum, 
Litecoin, Bitcoin, on the Binance Smart Chain and Bitcoin. So after you pick one, follow the instructions, boom, you're in. So it's going to be simple. Very simple, very duplicatable. That's what your boy uh, Marcus would say, that little dick bag. I drink sparkling water. This, um, it's like a Hispanic brand, I guess. Ta Topo Chico Sabores. It's pretty good. So it's a lime with mint on in it. Flavored sparkling water. So, hot summer day. It's kind of refreshing. It gives you that soda satisfaction, and it's not sugary like soda. But I do enjoy my soda, though, because I do drink a soda with dinner. That's the only time I drink a soda is with dinner. Because, um, I don't know, it just pairs well together. You, you eat it, you know, a nice dinner, and then you just drink down a nice cold soda with that. Phew, man, hits the spot. All right, so there we go. We hit the dashboard. And they also have an exchanger here, too. I, I love exchange. That's one of my favorite features. Uh, maybe I'll demonstrate it another time. So the next time I check in with earnings, what I'll do is I'll do this exchanger. So let's say since I'm earning in Tether, so we'll put in the Tether TRC. And I'll probably pick a crypto here that I'll exchange it to. All right, I'll do that. And then from there... Um, it'll convert. I'll do the withdrawal. Boom. Right, so I'll do that in my next Polyvera update. I'll do that. Um, I think that'd be the best way to go. I have, I have an upcoming vacation, so I won't be able to check in with Polyvera next week. I mean, I can, but I won't be able to do it live, and I prefer to do it live with you guys. But we'll see. I don't know. Uh, I might, I might, um, do it off camera, but at the same time, I, I will demonstrate, um, you know, uh, the use of that exchanger in another video um, as soon as I can, is all I can say. All right. And uh, we'll see what happens with all that as, uh, you know, it'd be cool. It'd be cool. Uh, as long as Polyvera is still around by the time I come back from my vacation, they were good to go. All right. It's just... Uh, because uh, it'll be next week, I'll be on vacation, and the week after that, I'll be back in business. So then we're just going to proceed from there, you know, how we go about it. Oh, shit. Didn't realize. Okay. I was just looking at something here. I was like, okay, I didn't realize I had this. But yeah, so uh, Polyvera is actually a very good opportunity. A wide variety of flexibility and plans. And... For me, I always like status quo, especially in a positive way, where if you could sit in the same place or just be in the same place consistently and not have too much movement so that we could just be focused, I'm all good with that. So we'll do it again. But yeah, um, so I'll demonstrate Exchanger in an upcoming uh, video. On, on the next update, given that, you know, the platform is still running smoothly and all that stuff. And uh, there is an opportunity to do so. That's something that I'll be looking forward to do. That way I'm gonna, I could demonstrate the work in progress. But yeah, so uh, that's your latest Polyvera update. It's actually uh, pretty good so far. Uh, we're in this uh, new cycle. So... We'll see what's in store in terms of uh, the, the, the life and growth of Polyvera. So the link is in the description. Just do your research. See if it's something that you like. It's something for you. I can answer questions, comments, concerns, anything like that. Uh, if you want to join me in my Telegram group, we could talk about all kinds of stuff. It's a wide open forum of talking about whatever you want to talk about. Also got my link tree. If you like mashed up music, I do take requests. If you want to hear something, I'll throw something together. And other than that, I'll see you in the next one.